video, you will learn how to install and commission the One Controller for residential sites. Let's have a look at what you'll find in the package. Note that the Quick Installation Guide contains a drilling template. Before installing the One Controller, let's identify the controller's interfaces. You can find the LED indicators and a push button on the front side. On the bottom of the controller, you can find two ports the LAN port for the Ethernet cable and the power USB-C port for the power adapter cable. Before you begin setting up the One Controller, make sure you have downloaded Solar Edge Go onto your mobile device and you have access to the site. You can mount the One Controller on a wall or place it on a stable surface. If you decide to mount it to the wall, use the drill template to secure the screws into the wall while maintaining a 40mm distance between them. Then hang the One Controller on the wall. You can connect the controller to the internet through the home router using either the provided Ethernet cable or a Wi-Fi network, as shown in this video. Next, connect the power adapter cable to the One Controller. Then, plug the power adapter cable into the AC outlet and wait until the power indicator LED is solid. This may take up to one minute. Now let's commission the One Controller in the Solar Edge Go mobile application. Open the Solar Edge Go app and tap Manage. Select the site where the controller will be added. Tap Add Device. Select One Controller. Tap Next. Scan the QR code on the back of the One Controller with your mobile device, or alternatively, enter the serial number and password of the One Controller into Solar Edge Go. Select the Internet Connection Mode, either Ethernet or Wi-Fi. In this video, we will show the Wi-Fi option. Tap Configure Wi-Fi. Select the relevant network, enter the password, and tap Connect. The One Controller is now ready to use. Tap Done. You can confirm that the One Controller is connected when the device displays a solid local connection indicator LED and appears in the device inventory list in Solar Edge Go. That's it. The One Controller is successfully installed and commissioned. You are now ready to pair third-party devices to the One Controller. For the details on the pairing process, see the link in the description of this video. For more information on the Solar Edge One Controller, see Edge Academy and our YouTube channel. Thank you.